I'm a huge fan of Ben Orland's work. And if you haven't seen his book, Math with Bad Drawings, or his website with the same title, I highly recommend that you check it out. He had a recent post called Six Strategic Pen and Paper Games, and it's really good. It teaches these fun strategic games. And so I thought I'd take a stab at taking the games he suggested and then translating them to work in an online space. So let me walk you through this first game called Black Hole. The gameplay works like this. Once you've copied the pyramid, uh, each player decides which color they'll be for their font. Player one will select a circle. You just double click the circle you want and you add the number. So in here, it's the first round. So you put one, make sure it's your font color that you selected. And then player two will do the exact same thing. Double click a different circle, any one you want, and do the number one. The second round, you double click a new circle, you add the number two, and so on. So play continues as, as players are going through adding each number into a different circle. And this is where the strategy comes in. Now a quick pro tip to make this faster, so you don't have to double click a circle and then change your font color each time. Just take the number that you've already added, copy it, and then double click the new circle, paste it, hit backspace and then make the next number that you're going to add and that way it makes it a lot faster for you. After 10 rounds there'll be one circle that is left unfilled. That is the black hole and so the black hole destroys all its neighboring numbers. To make that work you're going to uh, hold down the shift key, select the black hole and select the neighboring circles. Just click on each circle and then go over to the fill button and click the black and now you've seen which numbers were destroyed and players will then add up their numbers and the one with the lower score that was destroyed so in this case blue only lost nine and red lost 18 so blue wins because they lost the least amount that's how it's played all right thanks for checking this out i hope you can play the game i hope your students can play the game uh, visit my website if you want to have more resources to support distance learning and i'm happy to help take care